Hello, my name is Veer Animus of VA Games. Welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man X. This is episode 6, and today we're going to be taking on Boomer Kowanger. Let me begin by declaring that Storm Eagle and Boomer Kowanger are my two favorite Mavericks, quite possibly in the entire X series, even though they are nearly virtual opposites of one another. When you look at Storm Eagle, you have a proud warrior. He has a very keen sense of justice, a very strong idea of good and evil. He seems to want to do the right thing, and he has a, a great deal of honor and integrity. He has a lot of respect for X. Uh, when you look at Boomer Kowanger, he actually doesn't have any of that. He doesn't have any kind of sense of right and wrong. He doesn't know what justice is. He doesn't know what evil is. He analyzes the situations very procedurally, very mathematically, and completely stoic without any kind of emotion. It's this kind of analytical personality that really draws me to Boomer Kowanger as a character, you know, in contrast to someone like Storm Eagle. When you put it all together, you get a really cool maverick, a really fun stage, and really awesome music. The stage is a tower, as you can see, and it consists mostly of these vertical segments, which back in Mega Man Classic were extremely difficult and very frustrating. They were a nightmare in some cases because of how not agile Mega Man was. Contrast that with X, who is extremely agile because of the dash boots, and vertical segments actually become one of my favorite parts of playing a Mega Man X game. As we approach the boss, I would like to take a moment to discuss a bit of confusion that I've noticed in the online community regarding Boomer Kowanger's classification as an animal in the Animal Kingdom. As you may or may not have noticed, all of the Maverick bosses in the Mega Man X series are designed w after some animal, and Boomer Kowanger is actually no different. His name, Kowanger, comes from the Japanese Kowagata, which means stag beetle. As a matter of fact, Gravity Beetle from Mega Man X3 is actually Boomer Kowanger's brother, and uh, Gravity Beetle is a rhinoceros beetle. Uh, together, the brothers and X actually fought in the Maverick Hunter's 17th Battalion. Um, so they're, they're all actually very familiar with one another, and X likes them both. Be warned, this guy is extremely difficult if you come into this fight unprepared, so let me give you a little bit of advice. Stay off the ground. Kwanger is one of the only bosses in Mega Man history that is incapable of jumping or moving through the air, so the only way he can get you is by throwing his horns as a boomerang. So what you should do is stay on the wall, jump down only when you want to pepper him with a few careful uncharged shots. Um, he likes to teleport into you so he can use his horns to throw you around, which causes tremendous damage, so absolutely maintain your distance. Uh, when you beat this guy, you'll get the boomerang cutter, which will be necessary to pick up an item later. Uh, but for now, that's the end of this video, and next up is Spark Mandrill. So uh, I hope to see you there. Thanks for watching.